Hello again, this is Robert Veach here. This is my video review of the Uzoli brand, their wireless indoor outdoor 7.5 inch diagonal color display weather station with three remote sensors. And this is unique because it has an atomic clock built in, a barometer, and it does moon phases. Comes with a nicely written instruction manual, a power supply to power it if you don't want to go battery wise, and three sensors. Now this has all kinds of settings, has adjustable brightness, has an alarm clock, two different alarm settings, and um, the weather, th these can work up to 167 feet away. They're IPX4, so you don't have to worry about water on them, but you don't want to put them directly where they're going to get rain. You want to put them under an eave or something like that. They will transmit a nice long distance, as I mentioned, 167 feet. And uh, this does support the local uh, WWVB signal, which is that uh, atomic clock on there. I went through it, I already set the clock so it's uh, showing the correct clock and then it'll sync probably at night. There's high and low temperature settings, you could have some alerts on here. You could set it so that it alerts you when it's 32 degrees for freezing outside. You can pick the city that you're near, so I picked Chicago because I'm in Illinois. And then that allows you to see the sunrise and the sunset numbers right there, which is really nice. So when I first powered this on, I was getting temperature reading right there before I even put any batteries in the sensors. And I figured out that that was, I've got another brand outside and it's transmitting. But I also have this one right here on and I have the batteries in place. Just simply just put double A batteries in there just like that there is a channel button right there so you have channel one two and three this one's on channel three which is why it's showing right there channel three you do have a, a Fahrenheit or Celsius button right there and you have a transmit button so that you could sync this up if it doesn't automatically sync up and Emmanuel goes over all of those things of how you could synchronize everything uh, it's really uh, intuitive. The display is really nice if you look at it right here. So what you see, you see that outside sensor, temperature, humidity, right now basement, temperature, humidity. There's the forecast, see it's uh, partly cloudy. There's the sunrise, there's sunset, Chicago area, and uh, even has tide low and high. And then there's the time, June 28th, Tuesday, and then here's the temperature that it's reading right on the device itself, 73 degrees at 39% humidity. So usually the uh, automatic atomic clock will synchronize at night when the signal is strong. That's just how it always works. And if you look at the back right here, it has the charging port right there. You can also put two AA batteries in there. And that way, if you unplug it, you won't lose all your settings, so that's nice. It has these legs right here that open up, allow you to stand. And then it has a open there for a hook or a nail that you can put on a wall if you want to put this on a wall. Also has a USB-A port, which is nice, so that you could charge a device. So again, there's a lot of settings on here. The manual goes over all the settings here. There's a basic one right here where you can adjust the brightness level right there because if you have this by your bed you want to dim it down from four three or two or one right now it's on the brightest setting and it's a nice display you can see it on multiple angles it doesn't have the typical lcd problem that you see and you've got your alarm snooze up here right there and you can even turn the light on and off right there for sleeping or dimming it so here I'm demonstrating the USB-A port on there, so you could charge anything. So here I'm charging an LED work light, but you could charge your mobile phone right by your bedside, and that's really nice. So what's great about these displays is that, you know, you can have three sensors plus the base, and you don't have to use all of them, but if you want to, you can monitor different rooms in your house and have one for outside. So you have this by your bedside, so you've got the temperature, humidity, 
Uh, you have one outside, so you've got temperature and humidity. You can see it's 85 degrees now, 36%. Then you can put this one in a bedroom, this one in a baby's room, this one in your basement. It allows you really to monitor four different zones, which is really nice. And that display is nice to have by your bedside and the fact that you can charge your mobile phone. So the manual does have a lot of information on here. And it tells you how to go through all the settings and how to get this set up for your zone and how to, to do the time. It's very simple and it worked the first time I tried it. Another nice feature it has, it has mold risk. So it's gonna look at the percentages of the humidity and it's gonna warn you what the mold risk is. And that's nice so that you know what the mold risk is in your house at the base station. The menu allows you 12 hour format or 24 hour format. You can pick whichever one you're familiar with. So after testing this and going through all the settings and seeing how the menu works, it's a nice product. It was relatively easy to use. And it seems like all these things are really accurate. I did put better than the other ones and I was getting multiple temperatures. I was getting three plus the base. So this product is nicely built. I'm gonna give it a full five-star rating. Please remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to alert the new video uploads. And if you like this review, please hit the like button. I hope the information I presented helped you with your buying decision. Thank you for watching.